So now what we want to do is we want to countersink the rivet holes that we're going to do the flush mount rivets. And to do that, we're going to use with a flush mount tool. This one's got Teflon so you don't hurt the aluminum. And it can be set in thousands of an inch of depth so that you can drill precisely how deep you want. We already have this one set. This is already set for number 40 skin rivets. So we'll just... It might help if I get off the block of wood. Now when the skin rivets go in, and they're tiny little things and tricky to use. Mexican jumping rivets. See how they're nice and flush cut? So now when we go ahead and squeeze them in there, we'll have a nice flush. And that's all we need to do. These are the three we're going to use. So we hope you found this informative. You only need to buy one of these tools if you do a lot of riveting, uh, especially on our airplanes with the skin rivets. Um, I think this tool is like $65. I have in a variety of sizes. But it's a nice tool to have, especially when you get it dialed in and set. So we hope you found this informative. Thanks for watching, and have a good day flying your Grumman.